out of Chatfield, Minnesota in 21. Dan Powers out of Wichita in four. This is going to be ugly. Heads up, fellas. Heads up, heads up, heads up. Cup stand to the green flag. It'll be Kirk and Keeter on the front row, ready to go back racing again. The top four to the show. Here we go. Tanoli is the other one that I don't think started, that's why. He broke it, right? Underway early here in B Main for the USRA Modifieds. Mitch Keeter led it at turn one. Terry Kirk took it away. Kirk will lead on the back straight away in 55. Good racing going on here. Down the front straight away this time by. Good side by side battle there. Still Terry Kirk by a car length. Mike Hansen, Thursday night's winner, into the third spot. You see the nose filler panel on the 0 2 of Tanner Mullins, that has jumped up and may cause him a little bit of trouble seeing. So far, so good. Good three-car battle still for the lead. Down the front straight away, it's Terry Kirk, Mitch Keeter, and the 12 of Hanson. Down the back straight away, Terry Kirk. Still your race leader in the 55. Then it continues to be the 52 of Keeter, the 12 H of Hanson. Final transfer spot right now is Casey Skyberg. Chase Sig trying to take it away in 18. Down the back straight away once again. Kirk in 55. Continuing to show the way. A good battle for second. A great battle for the final transfer spot as well. So far, so good for Kirk, Keeter, and Mike Hansen. One, two, three. Four spot continues to be the six of Casey Skyberg hanging on to the final spot to get into the A main tonight. Yes. Mitch Keeter trying to roll to the inside of your race leader. Terry Kirk on the back straight away here. Seven laps in of this 16 lapper. Good battle. There goes Hanson. Mike Hanson going to go from third to first in 12. What a move. A diamond move. We could see that coming. What a good one there. Mike Hanson, formerly out of Alta, Iowa now. Living in Dickinson, North Dakota in 12. Picked up his first ever win here at the Hummer on Thursday night. Now he's leading the B-Main, just trying to get in the show here in 12-H. Mike Hansen is driving away in 12 behind him. A good side-by-side -side battle. Mitch Keeter in 52, Terry Kirk in 55, and still Casey Skyberg hanging on. Now Paul Nisnik has got in the mix. Nisnik in 42, Sigan 18 side-by-side, -side, and Tanner Mullins from the tail. Mullins trying to come from the back, and a caution is out. Wow, that's Terry Kirk. He was in a transfer spot in 55. I did not see that happen, but Kirk was in a spot to transfer to the A main, and now he sits backwards in turn two. All right, going three at this time. Remember, the leader starts the race. Here we go, 10 and six to go. Final quick six laps here in the USRA modified B main. Ready to come back racing this time. by for your new race leader, Mike Hansen in 12. Mike Hansen has gone back to the race lead into 12. He'll try to drive away the final five circuits. It'll be Mitch Keeter, Chasey Skyberg, and right now Chase Sig. Sig into the fourth and final transfer spot. However, Tanner Mullins, Paul Nisnik, they're four wide. Down back straight away into turn number three. Good race in here. Behind your race leader, Mike Hansen in 12. Hang on, Casey Hansen will spin this, or Casey Skyberg, excuse me, will spin the six. Skyberg's around over in turn number one. He was in a transfer spot as well. Tough break for a couple of guys here that have been in transfer spots tonight. Well, 
He's going. Casey Skyberg looping around the sixth car, but he'll get back on the throttle. We'll stay under green. Three laps to go here for your leader, Mike Hansen. Then it's Paul Nisnik, Mitch Keeter, and we'll see who's going to be the fourth and final transfer spot. Tanner Mullins had gone to the tail. He's charged. Back up into a transfer spot. Chase Sig get a crossover and take it back away. Good battle for the fourth and final transfer spot here with two to go. This time by for Mike Hansen in 12. Mike Hansen one more time around the Humboldt Speedway. He'll bounce off that cushion. He'll come to the white flag. One more trip around for Hansen in 12. Mike Hansen, Paul Nisnik, Mitch Keeter, and we'll see. So far, it's Tanner Mullins. See if he can hang on to it in the 0-2. The checkered is out. Your winner of B-Main action, Mike Hansen in 12. Well, there it is. The USRA modified B-Main in the books. Top four that'll transfer include the 0-2 of Tanner Mullins, the 52 of Mitch Keeter, the 42 of Paul Nisnik and picking up the win of the Dickinson, North Dakota. Sponsored by G-Style Transport, VP Race Fields, Integra, Terry Phillips, Auto Sports, number 12, Mike Hansen. USRA modified main event. Your pole setter tonight out of May, out of Kansas, it's Darren Fuquay in the 87. To the outside, we'll find out of Hendricks, Minnesota, Chad Olson in the 10C. Tad Davis had a strong run here last night. He'll look to do it again tonight in the 75 out of Mount Hope, Kansas. Tad Davis inside of row two. Travis Sauer out of Elizabeth, Minnesota in the 1S. Third row on the inside out of Hallsville, Missouri. It's Matt Dotson in the 8D into the outside. Terry Schultz in the 90 out of Sedalia. Fourth row on the inside, driver from Chanute, Kansas. It's Peyton Phillips in the 98 into the outside. Dustin Strand out of Grand Forks, North Dakota in the 71. Fifth row inside out of Warrensburg. It's Dean Willie in the 68 into the outside. Out of Manor, Saskatchewan, Canada. Jet Big Eagle in the 99. Starting next, it'll be Ryan Gustin in the 19 out of Marshalltown, Iowa. To the outside of him, Kelly Esty out of Kelly Lake, Minnesota in the 37. Ryan Mickelson will be in the 15. He's out of Jamestown, North Dakota. To the outside, Lucas Conley out of Spring Hill, Kansas in the 17. Next up, Joey Galloway out of Manor, Saskatchewan, Canada in the 01. He made a field tonight. Good job, Joey. And to the outside, out of Nevada, Missouri in the TS Dump Trucking number 227, it's Chase Domer. Up next, Mike Hansen, night one winner here out of Dickinson, North Dakota in the 12 machine. And to the outside, we'll find the 42 in a Paul Nisnik out of Medford, Wisconsin in the all sports sales and service machine. Final row in the 52 machine out of Joplin, Missouri in the IROC race cars number 52. It's Mitch Keeter. And tail back tonight out of Wichita, Kansas. It's the 02 of Tanner Mullins. This is your 20 lap USRA modified main event. Set to go green here momentarily. Here we go, Darren Fuquay and Chad Olson bringing us down to green. We are underway with the USRA modifieds. Fuquay going to the race lead, Chad Olson up into the wall, we've got a crash at the flag stand as well. That is the 227 of Chase Domer and the 52 of Mitch Keeter here, crashing as we came to the green at the flag stand. Again for your pole sitter, Darren Fuquay in 87. Here comes Fuquay bringing him to the line. They thought about four wide down the front stretch. Once again, that had to shake out quickly and did as Terry Schultz backed out of it. Just as I say that, they go back three wide off a of two. Fuquay leading to the front. Darren Fuquay up on the cushion. Tad Davis heads up. Tad almost lost it. Good job of saving that thing in the 75. He'll lose one spot and that's it. Chad Olson will race by on the outside in 10. Here comes Matt Dotson on the bottom as well. They're gonna go three wide for second. Good battle back there for second now as Fuquay begins to check out on the rest of the field. We'll keep an eye on these guys. Once again, a little tricky over here off four for some of the guys. Dotson now down to the low side of the 1S. Good battle for position right there. Two wide in front of them with Davis. Good run up front. One car into the wall. Looked like to be Gustin. Ryan Gustin got up a little bit too high in turn one. Good racing going on around the Hummer here. Two and three grooves here behind your race leaders. Matt Dotson trying to make that bottom groove work, trying to roll to the inside of Tad Davis here for third. They're side by side. Chad Olson having one of the best runs he's had in his career in an open wheel modified. He runs in second right now, but it is all Darren Fuquay in 87. Then a pair of hot runners around this area, Matt Dotson and Tad Davis, as Dotson now has taken the third spot away from last night's runner-up finisher, Tad Davis. Davis will slip back to fourth. 
just in front of the 1S of Travis Sauer, Schultz in sixth. Still Fuquay at the start finish line, then Chad Olson, Matt Dotson, Tad Davis, Travis Sauer, Terry Schultz, and it's Peyton Phillips. Behind them it's Dustin Strand, Jet Big Eagle, Ryan Michelson is there, Kelly Esty is there as well. That will round at the top 10 as Michelson shooting sparks off the wall in turn two. Looks like welding going on over there on the quarter two tonight. Up front still all the Darren Fuquay show along with Chad Olson. Those two have checked out. Matt Dotson now has separated himself from that battle with Tad Davis. He comfortably sets in third on the podium so far. No change behind him as Tad Davis holds on to the fourth spot. Ryan Gustin struggling to get going here. He's running outside of the top 10. In fact, he's running about 12th. We're gonna lose one car. That's Dean Willie in the 68. He's off the pace. We'll continue to race though at the front of the field. It is still continuing to be all. Darren Fuquay by a dozen car lengths, easily in 87. Blistering pace being set for the Mayada Kansas driver in the big time Bell Bonds number 87. Like Ch Chris said, Chad Olson comfortably in that second spot, no change there. Matt Dotson doing everything he can to try to figure out the best line to gain some ground. Now Mitch Keeter takes his ride to the infield. Keeter's night done in the 52. Down the back straight away, it'll continue to be your race leader, Darren Fuquay. He will see the back of the field here if we stay green. Working on the halfway point this time by. It'll be 10 laps in, 10 to go for Mayetta, Kansas racer Darren Fuquay in 87. Ryan Gusson now one spot out of breaking inside the top 10, currently setting in that 11th spot. Chad Olson way up on the high side, Matt Dotson way down low on the hub. Dotson seems to be making some ground there down low, just past halfway. They'll bring him around again. Fuquay still your leader. 11 laps in, nine to go. Fuquay, Olson, Dotson, Davis. And Travis Sauer, good top five here. And as we said, Darren Fuquay is about two laps away, maybe three from encountering some lap traffic here. Joey Galloway, the first one, looking to go a lap down in 01. So we'll keep an eye on that situation. We got great battles going on back in the field with Dustin Strand. Great battle back there with Esty, the Patriarch, trying to hold him off. Strand will get a run on the high side, but Esty will take that spot away from him. That's just in front of Gusson as he tries to continue to his make his way inside the top 10, way past the halfway at this time. Still Fuquay, Olsen, but Matt Donson now beginning to run down Chad Olsen. Travis Sauer and Tad Davis, a good one. That's for the fourth spot as they swap spots. Darren Fuquay now at the back of the field. Good news for him as he's running around the top and the three lap cars in front of him running around the bottom as Fuquay comes to the line with six to go. Fuquay now right on the back side of the 01 machine of Galloway. Lucas Conley just in front of them. Those will be the first two cars to go a lap down if we get to that point, and we surely will because Fuquay is flying on the high side. Tad Davis now a little bit of trouble. Might have got into the wall there off of two. We'll keep an eye on him as the 1S has begin to distance himself away, Travis Sauer. Look out over here off of corner number one and two, Lucas Conley done for the night. Conley onto the infield as he was just about to go a lap down. Your race leader, Put him a lap down, put Galloway a lap down as well. Down the front straight away, that battle for second. Not a battle anymore, there went Matt Dotson. Dotson drove right by the 10C of Chad Olson here with four to go in this one. It is Darren Fuquay, Matt Dotson, Chad Olson, Travis Sauer, and Tad Davis this time by 17 in. Three laps to go that time around. Can Matt Dotson do anything to catch the second place? Machine, here we go. Good battle down the back chute. Fuquay is there. Dotson now takes to the high side. Dotson doing everything he can. Running out of time, though. Just a couple laps to go. Two to go for your race leader, Darren Fuquay in 87. Matt Dotson is running him down, and he's running a completely different groove. Not sure he's going to have enough time, however, as there's only one lap car right in front of him, and the white flag about to fly for Fuquay in 87. So looking for the white flag for Fuquay was right there. That was the white flag lap. Time, yep, just do it next time. White flag will fly this time around now for Mayetta, Kansas driver Darren Fuquay. White flag in the air, one to go. Matt Dotson doing everything he can on the high side. Chris Steppen bring him on home. Good battle for third as we come down for the final trip around the Humboldt Speedway. Night number three for the USRA Modifieds. And a turn three out of turn four, your USRA Modified winner, Darren Fuquay in 87.
Well, there it is. A good one in the USRA Modifieds here tonight. The top five finishes will run this way. Tenth will go to Tad Davis in 75 in fifth. Fourth will go to the 10C of Chad Olson. Third to the 1S of Travis Sauer. Second to the 88D of Matt Dotson. He gave it a run and he charged after your race leader, but he'll come home second. And picking up the win, he'll roll across the scale. He comes to you out of Mayetta, Kansas, the big time. Bail Bonds, 87, Darren Fuquay. Happy crew down here to greet Mayada, Kansas driver Darren Fuquay! <laughs> Everybody's been doing that this weekend. That's a heavy, that's a heavy piece, Fuquay. Congratulations, brother. Nice seeing you. Come on over here in front of the car. Dominating fashion out there tonight. The old 87 ride was hooked up. Tell us about the run. Well, we've been making changes all week and uh I think we finally found what we needed there. So we had to drive all the way around the corner and coming off too. So I'm looking forward to this season. Pretty stout weekend here at the old Hummer. Nice way to start the season. Three races in a row, three good points races. Yeah. Uh, didn't tear much up. Looks like I maybe tore the spoiler up a little bit, but I'll take that. Uh, I just got to thank all my sponsors, uh, Big Time Bell Bonds, Sun Leasing, Paisley Farms, San San, or Dan Dan the Sonic Man, uh, my grandpa, Murphy, for everything that he does for me, uh, above and beyond. Got to thank him, and um, I know I'm forgetting somebody. Sorry, Auto Sound, the airport, um, just everybody that helps out, all the guys, and all my fans that come drive down here and watch me every night. It's a nice round of applause for Fuquay. Darren Fuquay, congratulations, bud. Thank you. We'll let them celebrate down here with the entire crew as they made their way out here. All right, we've got through.